Hey, Jake here. Today we're going to brew with Fellow's new Stag pour over dripper using the simplified fill up method. For those of you who want a quick and easy way to brew a great cup of coffee. Let's begin. Remove the ratio aid and place the dripper on your favorite cup. Today we're using Fellow's tasting glass, which was designed to fit perfectly with the Stag dripper. Stag's ratio aid is going to help you easily determine the right amount of coffee to use. On the inner wall, you're going to see a single dot and a double dot. The single dot is for the tasting glass. The double dot is for Stag Carafe. Today, since we're just brewing a single cup of coffee, I've added coffee to the single dot. We recommend a medium grind. It's important to pre-wet the filter to remove any paper taste. Pour hot water over the filter and let it drain. After that drains, remove any excess water. Each dripper comes with a funnel. This just makes it a little easier for you to load your coffee. Once the coffee's in, give the dripper a little shake to level out the coffee bed. And now we're ready to brew. Next, using water at about 200 degrees Fahrenheit, we're gonna bloom the coffee to release the CO2. Slowly pouring water into the dripper, we're gonna pour until all of the coffee grounds are saturated. Wait about 30 seconds for the coffee to fully bloom and degas. Today, I'm showing you the fill-up method. This is where the process differs from a traditional pour-over. For the fill-up method, we're just gonna fill up the dripper with hot water. Now the coffee itself will drip down in about two minutes, filling up the cup. The dripper itself is vacuum insulated stainless steel, so you'll have less heat loss and a more consistent brew temperature. Given we measured out the coffee with the ratio aid, we know the coffee to water ratio is right on if the tasting glass is full. And that's it. A great cup of coffee without the hassle. 